Here's a little 3D model that I kind of created with a friend of mine for an exhibition in, no, oh, yeah, it's an art exhibition in, in LA. I was asked to submit a, a piece of work. It was, a, it was a Woody Allen tribute exhibition. And um, I thought, well, I could just submit a 2D flat Woody Allen image, but I thought, well, let's try something different. So I submitted this guy, but I had, a, I had some help from a friend in, in America. But basically what I did was, I sent him this image, and I sent him this image, and then he gave me this, which was like, ooh, this is great, you know. So he, I think he did that all in ZBrush, and then from from that Im image we we created, oh, oh, oh no, there's a picture missing. I had a really good picture of Woody Allen doing a really good pose in the New York scene, but he's gone. You know. But anyway, never mind. But anyway, that's my that's my kind of like a voyage into 3D. Artwork, and I also designed this little character for for YouTube uh, a couple of years ago. Um, and that, you know, they they it was just a little icon that I created, and but they but they made a, a few kind of 3D fellas. And I was in New York a few months ago, and and that's him on my uh, in my hotel room. And I did a white stripes one just because I like the white stripes. I just did a gig. In Manchester, for okay, I'll do a white stripes one, and then, and I'll post it online, and just just for as many, just just so as many people can see my work, basically, I post it on gigposters.com, and like six months later, the white stripes actually phoned me up, the management phoned me up, and said, hey, we've seen your poster. I actually shat myself, but we're gonna, <laughs> we're, gonna, we're gonna sue you. I thought they're gonna sue me, basically. Like, Please send that poster offline. But instead, I said, no, we actually want to work with you. But wow, you know, it's like it's like a brain meld. You know what I mean? Oh. It's, it's like four o'clock in the morning as well, you see, because they're ba being based in LA. It's kind of like seven hours behind. It's just from out of the blue. I don't know where they got my phone number from, but they found my phone number, phoned me up, and thought, "We want to work with you." And I thought, "Okay, what do you want me to do?" So we did this. This was like a, a USB stick, and. Um, you know, basically, it was like a limited edition of 333, and the album was on it. You know, and basically, just plug it into your computer and obviously upload it onto your computer. And then six months after its release, I get an email saying, "Oh, it's been nominated for a Grammy Award." But this is crazy, man. You know, this is, and 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 this and that's how my kind of career really took a took a diversion in in kind of like um, in choosing to do characters and, and caricatures.